Kanye West, Kanye West born, the 8th of June 1977, age 46 years, Atlanta, Georgia, United States. Kanye West spouse, Kim Kardashian M, 2014-2022, Kanye West record labels, Rockefeller Records, Def Jam Recordings, more. Kanye West Awards, NME Award for Villain of the Year, more. Kanye West full name, Yee. Kanye West net worth $400 million USD. Kanye West about, Yee is an American rapper, singer, songwriter, record producer, and fashion designer. One of the world's best-selling music artists with 160 million records sold, West has won 24 Grammy Awards, the joint 10th most of all time and most awarded for any hip-hop artist jointly with Jay-Z. What is Kanye West's net worth? Kanye West is an American producer, rapper, fashion designer, an entrepreneur who has a net worth of $400 million. When Kanye was a multi-billionaire, he was one of the, the three richest self-made black people in U.S. history. Kanye gained widespread fame upon the release of his 2004 album The College Dropout. Today he is one of the most successful and awarded musicians on the planet with 24 Grammy wins out of 75 nominations. In recent years he has pivoted away from music towards the business world, earning at least $100 million per year from his various endeavors. The vast majority of his earnings have come from royalties and other earnings related to his Yeezy brand and Adidas partnership. But his outspoken views and controversy have cost him many sponsors and partnerships over the last few years. Kanye owns the Yeezy apparel line outright 100%. During his time partnering with Adidas he earned a royalty on every dollar of revenue generated. The Yeezy brand generated $2 billion per year in revenue and $250 million in profit for Adidas. At the peak of his partnership with Adidas, the Yeezy brand was estimated to be worth a $4 minus $5 billion on its own. In March 2021, a UBS valuation estimated that Yeezy adds $3 to $4 billion to Kanye's net worth bottom line. The same report estimated Kanye's former deal with The Gap previously added $1 billion to West's net worth. Kanye West personal life, West had an on-and-off relationship with designer Alexis Pfeiffer that lasted from 2002 to 2008, and he dated model Amber Rose from 2008 to 2010. He began dating reality star Kim Kardashian in April 2012, and they were married in May 2014. Together, the couple have four children. In January 2023, it was reported that Kanye and Australian architect Bianca Sensori were married informally in a private ceremony in Beverly Hills. Kanye West Early Life and Career Beginnings Kanye Omari West was born on June 8, 1977 in Atlanta, Georgia. Following his parents' divorce when he was three, West moved with his mother to Chicago, Illinois. There, he began experimenting with music after meeting producer, DJ No ID, who mentored him. He received a scholarship to attend the American Academy of Art in 1997, but transferred to Chicago State University to study English. Eventually, he dropped out of school at age 20 to pursue his music career. After dropping out of college, West began making beats for local artists while he honed his own style. His first official production credits were for the debut album of Chicago rapper Grave, Down to Earth, in 1996. Other artists he produced for during this period include Foxy Brown, Derek, D. Dot, Angeletti, and Harlem World. Kanye West rise to fame and music career. In 2000, West got his big break when he began to work as a producer for Rock A Fella Records, working with artists including Ludacris, Alicia Keys, and Janet Jackson. His work on Jay-Z's 2001 album The Blueprint generated serious interest in West's talents as a producer. His production credits from this time period include an impressive roll call of talent including Jay-Z, Beyoncé, John Legend, Alicia. Keys and Janet Jackson. Despite his success as a producer, West's main dream was to be a rapper. In 2001, he managed to convince the head of Capitol Records to sign him to Rockefeller Records after being denied a contract with Capitol Records. After a serious car crash in October 2002, where he shattered his jaw, West was inspired and recorded the song Through the Wire with his jaw still wired shut. This song laid the foundations for his debut album The College Dropout, which was leaked months before its scheduled release date in August 2003. West used the time to remix, remaster, and edit it, postponing its release three times. The college dropout was eventually released in February 2004 to widespread critical acclaim, earning him 10 Grammy Award nominations, and eventually certified triple platinum in the US. As he began working on his second album, 
West invested $2 million into the production, even hiring a live string orchestra. Late registration was released in August 2005, selling over 2.3 million units in the United States by the end of the year. His subsequent albums include Graduation, 2007, 808s and Heartbreak, 2008 My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, 2010, collaboration album with Jay-Z Watch the Throne, 2011, Yeezus, 2013, The Life of Pablo, 2016, Yee, 2018, collaboration album with Kid Cudi Kids See Ghosts, 2018, Jesus is King, 2019, and Donda, 2021. West released the album Yeezus in 2013. The album reached number one on the Billboard 200 chart as well as on the US R&B and US rap charts and in four other countries. His album The Life of Pablo was released in 2016 and reached number one on the Billboard 200 chart and number two on the US rap and US R&B charts. West's single, 4-5 Seconds, with Rihanna and Paul McCartney, reached number one on the US R&B chart. In 2017 he was nominated for six Grammy Awards. His next album, Ye was released in June 2018. Unfortunately, Ye was the first album in Kanye's career to not go platinum. In addition to his own albums and releases, West has continued working as a producer and featuring artist for other musicians, including 6ix9ine, XXXTentacion, Lil Pump, Chance the Rapper, Kid Cudi, and Tiana Taylor. Other music-related projects he has pursued include his weekly, Sunday Service, orchestration with the Sunday Service Choir, where they have performed every Sunday since January 2019. He also collaborated with contemporary artist Vanessa Beecroft on two operas, 